What's going on campers? Camp Facer here. Today I'm going to show you guys how to make a voice disguiser on the PlayStation 4 in two different ways. Jason, where are you? Jason's coming, you guys. Stop them. I know, mother. That's why I'm going to kill them all one by one. First, I'm going to show you the cheap, easy, generic way. Then I'm going to show you the more complicated, professional way. Let's get started. Camp Facer. So before we get into this video, I just want to say that I have a horror movie related channel. I do a lot of horror movie collectible content, um, reviews, uh, Blu-rays. I, I play a lot of horror movie games, multiplayer games. Um, I do it all. So definitely check out my channel and please subscribe if you have not already. I appreciate that. You guys are awesome. Anyways, let's get started. So the first thing you're going to need to do this the generic, cheap, easy way. Don't forget, this way doesn't sound all that great. It works, but it's the way that most console players that don't have a lot of money, um, almost anybody can do it this way. It's, again, um, cheap, generic. Uh, I'm going to show you guys the basics of this. So, first thing you're going to need, obviously, is a PlayStation 4 controller. Next, you're going to need a headset with a microphone. It can be any headset. It does not have to be a PlayStation 4 headset. This is actually a HyperX. It's my wife's. She's letting me use this for the video. Um, yeah, so as long as it has a microphone attached to it, and the other side is a... 2.3 millimeter next you're going to need either an iphone or an ipad now if you guys don't have a 2.3 millimeter headphone jack that fits into the ipad or the iphone then you're going to need to pick up this iphone adapter it's about seven dollars eight dollars or so it has a male end that goes into your iphone jack and the other end has a 2.3 millimeter hole for your headphones. So you're going to need this 100%. Last but not least, you're going to need a set of earbuds. They're about 10 to $15 for cheap ones that'll work, but they have to have a little microphone attached. Um, about halfway down, you'll find a little microphone right there on the earbuds. And it has a little dot. You'll see the, that, that little hole in there is a microphone. You're going to need earbuds with a microphone. Next, you're going to need to download the free app called Voice Mod. It's in your app store. It's free to download. There's about uh, 30 to 40, 50 different voice disguisers on there. It's not hard to use. And now this app, the Voice Mod, what's important about the Voice Mod app is it's real time, you guys, which means as you talk, it converts your voice in real time to the voice changer. That's what you're going to need. A lot of voice changers out there record your voice and you have to play it back. So that's what's good about Voice Mod. Now, all you have to do is select a voice, and that's it. You just turn it on. You don't have to hit record or anything like that. Once you change your voice and you hear the voice come through, that's all you need to do, you guys. So play around with the different voices, and you get to know them, and pick and choose which ones fit your game accordingly, okay? And that's about it for that. First thing you're going to need to do, plug your adapter into either your iPhone or your iPad to accept the 2.3 millimeter for the headset you're wearing. Next, you're gonna need to turn your app on, the voice mod app, and leave on the voice that you want to use that suits your needs for whatever game you're playing. Next, you're gonna need to plug your earbuds directly into your PlayStation 4 controller. Just like that. Next, you're gonna have to put your earbuds into both your ears so you can hear the game through the PlayStation. Next, you're going to need to take the little microphone connected to the earbuds, if I can find it, right here. You're gonna have to put this little microphone between the headset and your ear. Make sure that the little dot is is in the hollow void. Make sure that dot is, the microphone dot is facing the, the headset. So when you do this, 
you could either tape it there or kind of like just put, place it there. Now when you're talking through your microphone, the sound to the, the app is going directly to your headset and everybody through the earbuds into the game is going to hear the voice disguiser. This is the speaker. The microphone's going directly into the earbud, to the controller, to the game. So now, essentially, everybody in the game hears your voice disguiser. Now, if they hear your real voice outside mixed in with the voice disguiser, what you want to do is either turn up the app or turn up the headset microphone or move the microphone closer to your mouth so they don't hear your outside voice. Um, if this is away from your mouth and the app's turned down, they're going to hear your loud voice coming into the little uh, earbud microphone. So if, if the louder you make this from the app, that's all they're going to hear, not your real voice. So that's how you do the cheap, generic way, um, the easy way. It's not that great. It does work. But now I'm going to show you guys how to do it professional through your computer or laptop okay you guys so here's the way to do it the professional way e on either a laptop computer or a desktop it doesn't have to be a gaming computer but if you do have a gaming computer that's a plus okay but you can have a, a, a basic um, desktop or a windows um, laptop but you're definitely going to need either one of those you guys okay so first off you need to plug your headset with a microphone directly into either your laptop or your desktop. You don't have to use a headset microphone. Um, I actually use a external uh, Yeti um, microphone, but you don't need this, but it just makes it sound a little better. Um, and I plug this directly into my PC. Okay, so next you need to plug your PlayStation 4 controller directly into your computer. Okay, um, you, via USB, directly into your computer or your laptop. Those are the few external things you need. You need the laptop or desktop. You need to plug your PlayStation 4 controller in. And you need a headset with a microphone or an external microphone. All plugged into either your laptop or your desktop. Okay, so what you're going to need to do is you're going to have to search Remote Play PS4. I'm not sure the actual address, but if you go to Google and search it there, and just click here, and this brings you to the PlayStation 4 Remote Play Download section. Now all you have to do is go to either Windows or Mac. If you have an uh, Apple Mac, I would do that, and this is for the Windows users. So basically just click that, and it'll give you instructions on how to download it. Um, I already downloaded it, so I have it directly to um, my computer right here. Um, and this is the Remote Play um, app. You need that. Okay, so next thing you're going to need is to search how to uh, download the Voice Mod Voice Changer. Um, and if you just type in Voice Mod in Google, it'll come up. And you click here. And then you just download. Okay, you guys, so you have both Remote Play and Voice Mod downloaded to either your laptop or your desktop. And that's all you need to do for that. I'm going to put both of those links down in the description below. Okay, so the first thing you're going to need to do is turn your PlayStation 4 on your television. You don't even have to have that plugged into your computer, okay? Don't even worry about that. Your computer is not actually running your PlayStation at all, okay? Um, so turn on your PlayStation 4, and you're going to double-click Remote Play. It's checking for an update. I think I already updated it. Okay, so now it just says you have to plug the controller into your computer. So I'm going to do that right now. Boom. Okay, so now you hit start. And it's starting up and connecting to the PlayStation 4. Okay, so now basically all it's doing is it's showing the PlayStation 4 on your monitor. Basically, that's all it's doing. It's not running through the computer at all. Um, the remote play application is, but not the actual system. Okay, so you guys have the remote play window opened up. The first thing you want to do, you guys, is go down to this microphone right here, and you want to unmute it so the in-game players can hear you talking and they can hear the uh, voice disguiser when you turn it on. Okay, so the next thing you guys want to do, it's very important, is go down to the bottom of your computer and see this little uh, icon here for the speakers? You want to go to your sound settings, basically. So I just usually right-click on that, and I go to sound settings. And in here, in the sound settings, you got to go down to your microphone, okay? 
and see that it's working right now but you want to make sure right here that your correct microphone is chosen for the voice mod so when you open up voice mod right here the app from uh right here, when you click on voice mod and this opens up inside your sound settings it should automatically have the microphone voice mod virtual audio device now if you're on this you want to be on the voice mod so you got to select the voice mod input for your microphone so that's very important and also if you guys have a i have my obs opened up it's another program if you have your, your other, other microphone, microphone on, on it's, it's going to pick, pick up your, your other your own voice, voice along, along with the voice, voice mod, mod. So, so you want to shut, shut that off but that's for advanced users. Um, yeah, so make sure that's working and you can close that out and you can go back to the game. Um, hold on, let me see, there we go. And okay, so now if you guys open up voice mod and you turn on voice changer. There you go, now you hear the voice changer. I am God here. And here's my own voice, so I put it back so I can hear my own voice. Um, so you can switch it back and forth while you're playing the game. You can either put this window over here and shrink it down and you can even blow this one up or shrink it down or make it bigger or full screen it. Um, and then again, put the voice on. You got different ones. The Titan and you got... Hello, I'm in a cave, you guys. Somebody help me. Or you could do... So there you have it. And that's it, you guys. And um, this is awesome. This is really professional and awesome. And I hope you guys like, share, subscribe. And that's it. Okay, you guys. So I hope this video helped everyone out. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. If you guys have any questions at all, please leave a comment down below. And I'll be more than glad to try to answer them for you and help you through these tutorial um yeah again make sure to like and subscribe to this video or this channel if you have not already i also have a join members button up top um there's different perks i also live stream video games all the time you guys again my move my my movie my channel is horror movie related collectibles a little bit of everything but mostly based around horror movies that's my passion um so yeah again please subscribe and you guys campers make sure to stay out of the woods